All right, 10 things that I love about my supercharged V6 Audi S4. All right, starting off at number one, we have the supercharger. All right, so sitting on top of the engine right here is the supercharger, and this thing allows the car to pull so, 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 so hard. And then on top of that, my most favorite thing is the sound it makes. So I have a Ram Air intake on here right now, and when this passes by, you can definitely hear it screaming. All right, for number two, let's take a look at the interior. All right, so from the jump, the interior on this car is absolutely beautiful. Now, this is a pretty old car from 2011, so everything's a little bit faded, but you can definitely see what this car once was and still is. So number two would have to be the wing back seats on this car. These are absolutely amazing. They hold you in place pretty well when cornering, and also the stitching on all four of the seats in this car, S4, S4, and then on both of the back seats. It's absolutely beautiful. And the seats are also adjustable. So you have multiple functions, lumbar support, all types of different features on the seats and the passenger seat as well. All right, number three. This car has carbon fiber trim scattered around the cabin. So on the door, on the center console, which flows nicely into the passenger and driver's side footwell. Also above the glove compartment, all the doors, passenger, rear, and also other rear passenger. It just adds a very nice sporty touch to the car. All right, number four on the list would be the 200 mile per hour speedometer on this car. Go ahead and fire it up real quick. All right, so this car tops out at 150 miles per hour, give or take, but Audi has decided to put a 200 mile per hour uh, mark on your speedometer, which is actually pretty cool. Now, you probably never touch those speeds in this car, but it's just cool to see. You never see 20 miles per hour on just a regular car. So it's definitely something special. All right, so number five on the list would be the headlights. So they're pretty foggy right now. I have to clean them off. But at nighttime, these lights look very aggressive and actually even elegant at nighttime the way they designed it. So definitely a beautiful touch to the car. All right, number six on the list, we have the drive mode. So we get comfort, auto, dynamic, and individual mode. So what these pretty much do is allow you to actually change the feeling of the steering wheel. Also, it makes the shifts a little bit faster or less fast for a comfort mode. And comfort mode also makes the steering wheel lighter. And individually, you can kind of play around with the differential and all types of things to kind of make the car drive how you want it to drive. All right, so number seven on this car will be the lightning fast shift. So as soon as you hit the button, you're shifting. Just like that, same with the downshifts immediately. And that's all due to the DSG transmission on this car, which makes these shifts excellently fast, half a millisecond or something like that. And of course, with a proper tune, you can make these shifts even faster. All right, number eight on this car, we have the exhaust note. Now, this car is completely stock as of right now, except for the Ram air intake in the front. But in terms of exhaust, it comes with an excellent sounding exhaust. So every cold start in the morning, you're going to hear this car rumble. <laughs> Now it's not excessively loud, but you definitely will hear it. And then besides the cold start, when you're driving this car or giving it some gas, you're gonna hear the V6 and the supercharger kick in and the shifts sound absolutely amazing. All right, number nine on this car will be the Quattro all-wheel drive system. So this car, all-wheel drive, all four tires are launching you every single time. So what this means is that the car absolutely pulls from a standstill stop. And also cornering and things like that, all four tires are working together to get you around that corner. So it's a very cool system to have in your car and you definitely feel all four wheels giving you traction every time you launch this car. All right, so number 10, the last thing on this list will be the launch control. So here's how you activate that. Pretty much make sure the car is in dynamic mode, traction needs to be off, Hold the button down to get ASR off. Next thing you want to do is throw the car in drive. Make sure everything's off. Also throw the car into the manual mode. All you want to do now is hold the brake down all the way and then press the gas pedal all the way down. Pop up to 3000 RPMs and just let out the gas. Yeah, 
yeah so definitely is a pretty exciting feature and this car is insanely quick on the low end so definitely definitely love this car all right those are the 10 things i love about audi s4 you'll see more content from me go ahead and subscribe to my channel drop a like on this video to see the progress of the audi s4 other than that thanks for watching